Wow. I've, I still have to watch it. Me it too. Is so on my yes. list right no now. No spoilers yet. No one I talked know. to me about it. La 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 la. Talking about it because <laughs> no you know intended. we get the screener. So you know, I'm like, don't talk to I me know. about it. Are you doing it. la 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 la? It's la la la. Get it? Right. La, get la, it. La. <laughs> Thank you. It were, it's Friday at this point in time. We're a little, you know, a little right. tired around here. So yeah. 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 There we go. I was like, come on, Susie, come on. I'm there with you. You got this. You got it. Okay. Cool. Jeff gave you a little, a little, a little push along. But yes, I do think that's a fabulous idea. I think that's awesome. All right, you guys, we do want to check in with our KCAL 9 weather watchers this evening. And we got a lot going on the last few days. Quite a bit of rain, quite a bit of snow. And as we do check in with our CBS and KCAL 9 weather watchers, we're going to start off right here with James Arredondo in Eagle Rock reporting 48 degrees, mostly cloudy conditions. As we check in with our Jim Rotter, 54 degrees in Seal Beach, mostly cloudy. And we're going to make one more stop on our weather watcher tour here. Mike Baxter reporting 53 degrees in Northridge. And looks like we can make one more stop. So how about a stop with Denise Kills reporting 51 degrees in San Dimas and a little bit of cloud covered dry conditions at the moment. But there's still a little bit of rain left over out there and a bit of snow. We're getting a look from our Fraser Park camera. The roads are slick as you make your way in and out of the grapevine for this holiday weekend. At this point, we're not seeing any snow, but there is a little bit of snow sitting to the north of Fraser Park. So that could enter the picture very soon here. So snow is certainly a possibility over the next couple of hours. As we get a closer look at radar, you're going to see snow through Wrightwood at the moment. A few flurries near Fraser Park and any moisture that comes through could turn to snow over the next couple of hours. And as we get a look at the big picture on radar, you're going to see more snow for Big Bear currently. Take a look right here. All of the white on your screen showing you just that. That is snow, more snow for Wrightwood. And as we get a look at future cast, you will see the possibility of snow right there closer to the Ventura County Mountains and the county line also through the New Hall Pass. That's a possibility through 1030. Windy conditions as well. As we check in with the 12 o'clock hour around midnight, still a little bit of leftover snow. And by 3 a.m., we're getting a whole lot drier into the early morning hours. By 6 a.m., still looking pretty dry for us. And then by tomorrow, keeping it dry, just windy. In fact, we've got wind advisories in store through 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Gusty northeasterly winds through the L.A. County Mountains, the Ventura County Mountains, the Santa Monica Range as well. And you'll see 19 mile per hour winds for Santa Clarita. Everybody else in the single digits currently, but we could see the winds really start to pick up over the next few hours. 54 earlier today, or excuse me, right now in downtown earlier today, we were in the upper 50s and low 60s. You'll see 54 downtown and 55 in Fullerton. And there we have it earlier today in downtown. We were at 62 degrees with average being 60. So we were below average in tonight. Temperatures dipping down to the 40s, drying out for the most part. And as we get a look at your seven day microclimate forecast right here, you're going to see temperatures staying in the 60s, conditions mild through Tuesday and Wednesday. Still nice, a little bit of cloud cover by Thursday and Friday, expecting a chance of rain coming in our direction. But other than that, tomorrow, the warmest day of the next seven, you're going to see upper 60s, a nice little treat as we come off of a week with a whole lot of rain, which also was a treat in a way as well. All right, back to you guys.